toy ideas. Um, you have been a contributor on so many different daytime talk shows and, and news Thank shows. You. And you really are the expert when it comes to all things toys and what kids are loving now. Yes. Well, I was really surprised because these are actually the books that I loved when I was growing up. Yes, and our parents loved and our grandparents yeah. loved. Yes, so these are the little golden books and you'll recognize them right away. They've been around since 1942. Oh my gosh. They have classic characters that we all know and love and recognize. And the minute that you see these books, you notice the certain qualities. The, of course, the gold spine that goes down the back. When you open up that first page, we all had these. We couldn't write, wait to write <laughs> our names in them. But what I love about this particular box set that we're bringing you is that you're getting five of the classic books five of them with characters that were developed back in 1940s and mm. 1950s that have been passed down from generation to generation. And they have a beautiful message. I mean, this is Scuffy the tugboat, but look at it, it's adorable. Scuffy was sad, Scuffy was cross. Scuffy <laughs> sniffed his blue smokestack. I mean, like, this is adorable. And you know, he was, and he was a little drawings. upset that because he actually was in a bathtub and he wanted to explore the world. But what's interesting throughout this story is that he does go out and explore the world, but by the end of the story, he realizes he loves sailing his little boat at home. Aww. So he goes and explores the world and does exactly so. A, a lot of great messaging <laughs> in all these books, but you'll notice those illustrations are fabulous. Very famous authors and illustrators throughout all of these books. So each one, as you go through them, you're going to see beautiful, beautiful page after page. So I just want to show you all the different titles, and we'll go through yes, each one exactly. of them actually over here on the table. But it's all about the fact that you're getting all of the classic characters, yes. uh, including... Pokey the little puppy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes. So we all remember reading this when we were little. If you haven't read it yet, it's a must. This was one of the first of the original 12 books that wow. came out. Yes, through the Golden Books. And this little puppy is very curious. So are his brothers and sisters. Yep. They get in a little bit of trouble. Remind me um, of my they, little puppies. They might dig some holes underneath the fence and go exploring. There's a lot of fun <laughs> in here, but this is a classic character for a reason. And again, some very good, very good stories built in. I love this one too the saggy baggy elephant. <laughs> now this little saggy baggy elephant lived out in the jungle and just did not know what kind of animal he was. And so he ran into a parrot and the parrot made fun of him and said, your ears are floppy and long and your nose is too long and your skin is saggy. But when the elephant sort of continued to explore, he found other elephants, realized he fit in just fine that like and a learned to love himself. <laughs> Stop it. Uh, $18.12. Oh, no. By the way, it comes in the little case too. So wait, let's keep yes. going with the, with okay, the so this is Toodle, and Toodle is a train that's in training, mm -hmm. and he's in training. His job is to stay on the rails while he's in training. However, he finds that the meadow and other things are way more entertaining. <laughs> so he goes off the rails, and the engineer in this story comes oh. up with a really fabulous way to um, encourage him to stay on the rails. Very, Over very 200 important. ordered, and I gotta <laughs> let you know that this is the only order of the season. So pick these up while we have them for $18.12. T3, 4, 2, 3, 3. Okay, this yes, is So this lion. is the tawny, scrawny lion. This lion Ryan realizes as he's out hunting for food that mm. as he's hunting he's burning a lot of calories and he's kind of <laughs> scrawny he's not getting very big well a rabbit who may have had some self-motivation came up with this fabulous idea that you don't really have to go out and look for your meals we can make you carrot soup oh yeah carrot stew so they make the carrot stew and the lion loves it and so I think that the bunny may have had ulterior motive for um, finding an alternative food for the lion but it's a really fabulous story and again those great great illustrations There's just so adorable. <laughs> and uh, this okay. is the Scuffy. This yes. is the one that we showed earlier. This adorable little little boat who really wants to explore the world and he wants to see fun things, but he doesn't realize how safe and happy he feels right at home. And at the end of the story, that's really the conclusion that he comes to. Oh, uh, you know what? I, th I don't think there's anybody that doesn't love these books or remember these books. I mean, these were the books in my kindergarten class. That's these right. are the books that my parents read to me. Um, you know, and these are the books that I, you know, chalked up with crayons on all the time, you know exactly. what I mean? Um, but they're the ones that you have a lot of fun with and they're the ones that really do evoke those memories but teach your children important lessons yes. and really help 
help them learn the fundamentals. Now, I want to show you, these do come with the little collector's book thing, right? Yes. So it's, it, you know, this is the case where all the books go together. You start the library today and you get it home to the kids. And you know, all the little golden edges yes, on the side all here. all those things we remember. I remember even going to the doctor's office and these were in the doctor's oh, yeah. office. And I, I would want to put my name in it so badly. But <laughs> I will tell you as a mom that story time has always been so important mm -hmm. to me. Since my children were born every night, we would bathe them and we would always read stories. And when stories were over, we'd sing we'd say our prayers, but it was our routine. I'm getting goosebumps because it meant so much to all of us as a family. These are the types of books we'd bring out because when you have a boy and a girl like I did, mm -hmm. and they were kind of far apart in age, yeah. they didn't always have interests in the same books. What I loved about these is that these satisfied them both. My son Gabriel loved them, my daughter Simone loved them. We could read them as a family, but you know what? My mom loves them too because my mom also read them growing up as a child. Oh and so she's reading stories that she read when she was a little girl to my kids. Well, it's the 75th year anniversary, which is really cool. The yes. fact that you're getting five of the books is really nice. Mm -hmm. So you're getting a full collection, that wonderful illustration on the cover. But then remember, every page has an illustration on it. The right. print is nice and big, so you can read it and the kids can read That's it. That's right. And you're getting all five books for the sale price of $18.12. Mm. Now, I want to let you know these are very, very popular this morning, and we have That's well great. over... 500 of these already picked up. You're getting every single title here. Scuffy the Tugboat, The Pokey Little Puppy, The Saggy Baggy <laughs> Elephant, poor, which is, by the way, the description Suki. of Alberti. <laughs> um, Tawny Scrawny Lion, and then <laughs> Toodle. Toodle, Toodle the train. Toodle needs to stay on the rails. He will learn. <laughs> He's going to learn by the end of the story, I promise. Oh, uh, well, you know, some people just, they, they, they're not meant for they're staying on the rails. They're not meant for the rails. That's it, and it's okay. <laughs> um, this is item T3423, $18.12. That is your sale price. 600 of these already spoken for. Everybody loves these. In fact, what I would do is pick this up and give one as a gift to, you know, your little one every single birthday, Christmas, whatever the occasion is, and then you give them the last book with the collector's case so that they know where everything is. Of uh, $18.12, what a great value there. All right, so we've got something else coming back in the show from uh, Elizabeth. This is our Melissa.